Nigeria Customs Service, NCS has seized two lorries and 1,046 cans of smuggled premium motor spirit known as petrol and deposited the smuggled petroleum goods at two foil stations for onward sales of the products to members of the public for 630 lirans per litre. Nigeria Customs Service in a news release on Wednesday said one of the suspected smugglers was arrested during the operations. The statement reads thus, the Nigeria Customs Service NCS, Operation Whirlwind has recorded significant success in its fight against fuel smuggling, seizing two lorries, 1,046 kegs filled with premium motor spirit PMS, and 12 drums of petroleum products. In a press conference held on Wednesday, the 9th of October 2024, in Yola, the Adamawa State Capital, the Comptroller General of Customs, CGC Adewale Adeni, represented by the Deputy Comptroller General of Customs, DCG Aliyu Alajogun, in charge of enforcement, investigation, and inspection, announced that since the operations launch on the 10th of June 2024, efforts have intensified, yielding further results across multiple border regions. He said, our ongoing operations have recorded substantial seizures in various locations, including the northwest borders in the Sokoto Kebi axis, the southwest borders around the Semi Badagri and Idiroko axis, and the southern borders in Cross River and Aqua Ibom states. I am pleased to announce that in this latest phase of Operation Whirlwind, we have seized two lorries carrying smuggled petroleum products, 1,046 kegs filled with PMS and 12 drums of petroleum products. Additionally, one suspect has been apprehended in connection with these smuggling activities, he noted. According to him, the seizures underscore the persistent nature of the challenge and the necessity of continued vigilance and action. The customs chief warned those engaged in illicit activities, stating that, the full force of the law will be brought to bear on anyone caught smuggling our nation's resources. He called on all Nigerians, particularly residents of Adamawa and other border states, to support the operation. Your vigilance and cooperation are crucial in our collective efforts to safeguard our nation's resources and ensure that the benefits of foreign price deregulation are fully realized by all Nigerians. He also announced the immediate auction of the seized products at two petrol stations in Yola, at the rate of 630 Nairas per litre. In the same vein, the national coordinator in charge of the operations, Comptroller Hussein Ejibudu also emphasized the negative consequences of adding smugglers to execute their illegal activities. Comptroller Idris 6 enhanced collaboration with security agencies in Katsina. The Nigeria Customs Service NCS, has called for stronger cooperation among security agencies in Katsina State to tackle cross-border crimes and internal security threats. This appeal was made by Comptroller Abba Aji Idris, the Customs Area Controller of the Katsina Command, during courtesy visits to various security agencies in the state on Thursday, October 10, 2024. While visiting the Air Force Base, Comptroller Idris stressed the importance of intelligence sharing and joint operations among all security agencies to combat trans-border crimes. He noted that such collaboration would enhance national security, promote unity, and eliminate rivalry among security outfits in the state. He also acknowledged the long-standing partnership between the NCS and the Nigerian Air Force in areas such as border management and capacity building. In response, Air Commander Gaba Ibrahim Jibia reaffirmed the Nigerian Air Force's commitment to working closely with the NCS to address security challenges in the state. He attributed the noticeable reduction in crime rates, particularly in frontline local government areas, to the improved synergy among security agencies. Comptroller Idris also visited the Katsina State Police Command, where he called for joint efforts to combat economic sabotage. He assured the police of the NCC's readiness to collaborate in intelligence sharing and ensuring a peaceful environment for Nigerians. Commissioner of Police Aliyu Musa welcomed the visit, 
describing it as a positive step towards strengthening the existing relationship among security agencies in the state. Other security agencies visited by Comptroller Idris included the Nigerian Security and Civil Defense Corps, the National Drug Law Enforcement Agency, the Federal Fire Service, and the Federal Road Safety Corps in Katsina. All the agencies pledged their support for enhanced collaboration and partnership to ensure effective service delivery in the state. Sazuwa Kong Nebe, bringing you the news in a more digital way.